Uh, I'm a registered voter and a credentialed uh, poll challenger in the state of Michigan. Um, I was a GOP poll challenger at the TCF Center Absentee Voter Accounting Board in Detroit, Michigan. Uh, on election night Tuesday from uh, 10 p.m. to 5 a.m., I was there at uh, approximately 3 to 3.30 a.m., and I saw the huge dump of ballots that were uh, delivered to the counting hall. I noticed that the uh, city of Detroit clerk's office, uh, had there was their emblem on the white van that showed up with the ballots. Uh, Janice Winfrey's name was on there and a number, presumably, uh, for Janice Winfrey's office. Uh, I estimated that it was over uh, 50 boxes that I counted, and I estimate that up to 1,000 could have been fit in each box, uh, large boxes. Uh, there was no chain of custody. There was no accountability. There was no transparency. Nobody knew where these ballots had been. Uh, they say had to be turned in at 8 p.m., uh, they showed up at approximately 3.30 a.m., so seven, seven and a half hours is a, lot, a long time for these ballots to be kind of in limbo, not with anyone uh, knowing where they are. Uh, there have been no answers up to this point, and whistleblowers are being intimidated. Uh, there is a campaign of terror that is being instituted by people such as Attorney General Dana Nessel to coerce public officials into certifying the vote and rubber stamping this insanity as quickly as possible. Keep in mind that you could not videotape at TCF. It was strictly prohibited, potentially a criminal act. That's why all of these sworn affidavits, there's hundreds and hundreds of them, are so important because they are the key proof that severe impropriety took place in Detroit on election night. So all we want is a proper, thorough, independent investigation into what the hundreds of whistleblowers are coming forth and saying with a forensic audit of all the suspicious ballots. We know uh, what these investigations would yield, and we suspect that the interests desperately trying to obstruct the investigations, I think we know what, what I think they know what would be found as well. So I, I implore you to do the right thing, and you know, for your country, for your family, for your conscience, and stop this fraud.